Hi, this is Trey Pastor. Welcome to my review of Sullivan's Travels. Uh, this movie stars Joel McCree and Veronica Lake, and this is written and directed by Preston Sturgis. You know, I had heard about this movie for a long time, so I wanted to see it. I know this was one of the, uh, you know, criterion, so it, no, I know it had a reputation for being one of the great uh, comedies. And this basically is the story of Joel McCree's character. He's John L. Sullivan, a famous Hollywood director who's known for making uh, comedies and stuff. And he, he wants to make us like a socially responsible movie about, you know, human suffering and stuff. But of course, his boss is telling him, listen, you don't know anything about suffering. Okay, uh, you know nothing of suffering. Uh, how, how can you do that? So he says, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to dress like a hobo, put a dime in my pocket, and I'm going to hit the road and experience whatever happens, happens. And then I'll have the experience to, to make a really good film about human suffering and, you know, and the travails of life that you have to go through because, you know, he's a rich, famous director, so he hasn't experienced any of that. And of course, it's his bosses are skeptical, but they agree to let him go with a proviso. <laughs> they actually uh, follow him, uh, you know, at a just, you know, at a distance to see, you know, to, you know, make sure they he's okay and protect their investment. But of course, you know, he he, he tries to get away from that and yeah, to, you know, to try to experience this human suffering, this you know, the, live this every man life, okay. But things keep obstacles keep going, coming up in his path, which kind of you know, keeps pulling him back to his old life, you know, to the his real rich life. And, he, and along the way, he meets a, a down-and-out actress played by Veronica Lake, who's kind of no-nonsense, who actually gives him a act, you know, displays an act of kindness towards him. And, you know, he agrees, you know, to, to help her, you know, because she's kind of fed up, you know, she's trying to, well, trying to be a wannabe actress, and she's kind of failing. And so he decides, to, you know, he's going to help her out. He's going to, you know, he doesn't want her to, Hitch a ride back to her hometown, so he agrees to to try to you know give her, the you know to borrow his car, his own, his own car, a friend's car, which is really his car, to you know the driver back, and of course, chaos ensues, and again, she the you know she discovers who he really is, and of course they decide to you know she decides to go on the road with him, while he's trying to you know get this experience of living the everyman and, and uh, trying to understand the you know the suffering of the common man. And this movie is freaking hilarious. Uh, uh, Joel McRae is, a, you know, is a great straight man. He gets he gets most of the straight lines. Everybody else is he kind of everybody else is kind of re- is does the comedy. So he's sort of the straight man in the movie, and he kind of reacts to everyone. You know, uh, 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 everybody else reacts to him. So you, you have all these uh, supporting actors. Actors that are absolutely hilarious in this. Uh, William Demers is in that, you know, from My Three Sons, who played Uncle Charlie. He's in this. Uh, again, Veronica Lake, I thought, did a good job as the support. And I think she has good chemistry with uh, Joel McRae. And you have various other actors that are, you know, you, you know, the movie execs and people that are following him, trying to, uh, you know, make sure that he survives this experience. And and it's absolutely hilarious him trying to. Uh, experience the life as a common man. Like I say, he's trying to experience it, but things keep, obstacles keep you know, uh, going in his path to kind of stop him from truly experiencing it. And it's a hilarious movie, but it also has a serious tone as well. And 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 without spoiling it, let's just say he comes to really get that experience that he wants. <laughs> okay. And, you know, he, at first, you know, the bosses were really hesitant about letting him do this, you know, saying that he, he has no experience with this. And worry about how he's going to survive, but it, you know this movie really, like I said, it's it's comedic, but it also has kind of a message to it as well, and it's really uh, really a great movie. I really enjoyed it a lot, okay, and it really uh, has a lot of emotion in it as well, uh, and, and of course the comedy, which is absolutely first rate. Again, a lot of great supporting character actors in this movie, which really kind of helps make the movie uh, what it is, and you have you know. And it's a really treat for the eyes, and I'm glad I, I got Sullivan's Travel. It's really an enjoyable film, and I definitely highly recommend it. Uh, and again, it's only 90 minutes. You know, it's black and white, but it's uh, old Hollywood, and I love old Hollywood films. And again, this is another kind of a satire of Hollywood. So, you know, when Hollywood, Hollywood likes to satire it, you know, make fun of itself. And this movie does it in spades. Again, so uh, Sullivan's Travels, I'm going to give it a, uh, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Uh, enjoyable little film. Okay, great performances by the cast and great supporting actor work, which kind of really makes the movie as well. But it also has a message in it as well, which is really important. And you'll get it when you watch the movie. 
Okay, anyway, let me know what you think of Sullivan's Travels. Have you seen it? What do you think of it? Uh, feel free to leave comments down below. And if you like this review, please subscribe button down below. I have links to my Facebook, my Twitter, and my Instagram in the description box, as well as my other channel, Paul's Views and Opinions. Link will be in the description box. Please check that out as well. And this is Trey Pastor saying so long and take care.